Okay. Kita pergi kepada how to calculate the distance between point A and point B on the Cartesian plane in the diagram below. Okay, first. Okay, first sekali kita tengok kepada coordinates. Okay, tengok pada coordinates A and B. Okay, plot dulu kat sini coordinate A and B. Okay, so A is... Um, A is 1, 7 and B is 5... One, okay. Okay, so don't have common as this because uh this one x equal to five, and this one x equal to one, and then for y equal to seven, and this one y equal to one. Okay, so you must use this formula. The formula is, okay, x square my uh x two minus x one square plus y two minus y one square. Okay. First, kita change dia punya ink dulu. Mana, mana, mana. Okay, green. Okay, first you label. Okay, you decide whether this one becomes X1 and Y1 or this one becomes X1 or Y1. Okay, depends on you. So, first, this is X1. This is Y1. Okay, and then this is why B becomes X2 and Y2. Okay. So, use formula. Okay, write down distance. Okay, distance AB equal to square root. Okay, so start with X2 minus X1. So, 5 minus 1. Okay, 5 minus 1 square plus with 1 minus 7 square. Oh, sorry. 1 minus 7 square. So, it's become 4 square plus negative 6 square. Okay, so 4 square equal to 16. And then, negative 6 square equal to 36. Okay, and then you plus, it's become 52. Okay, square root 52 equal to... 7.21 Okay, 7.21 unit Okay, this is the answer Okay, distance AB equal to 7.21 units Okay, right, this is method 1 Now I teach you method 2 The same question but use method 2 So first, for method 2, you must draw triangle So, A Okay, draw a line to B. Okay, and then A going down here. And then B going here. So, this is intersection line. Okay, this is intersection line. So, this one become point C, for example. Okay, now you find the distance between A and C. So, first, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, so 6 unit. Okay, and next for B to C, the distance is 1, 2, 3, 4. This one, okay, this one become 4 unit. Okay, 4 units. Okay, next, use Pythagoras theorem. Why Pythagoras theorem? Because this is hypotenuse. Okay. Okay, so distance AB. Equal to square root, okay, 6 square plus 4 square equal to 36 plus 16. Okay, becomes 52 and then you will get the same answer with parameter 1, 7.21 units. Okay, so there are two methods. Okay, first method, you use coordinate. Okay, x2 minus x1. And then y2 minus y1. This is first unit. Yeah, sorry, this is first method. Okay, second method, you find the distance first. Okay, and then use Pythagoras theorem. And then you will get the same answer with method 1. Okay, clear? Okay, now we go to next example. Okay, calculate the distance between point P and point Q. Okay, you need distance lah. Dia guna jarak kan. So, P and Q. So, this is hypotenuse. 
Okay, so senang je. Okay. So, distance PQ equal to square root. Okay, 3 square plus 5 square. Okay, 3 square equal to 9. 5 square equal to 25. Okay, and dapat berapa? Sekejap, cikgu nak kalkulator ya. Hmm. Okay, 3 square. Oh. 3 square plus 5 square. 34. Square root 34. Square root 34. Dapat jawapan dia. 5.83. Units. Okay. Settle. Untuk A. Next, for B. Okay, for B kita, cara nak senang, kita guna yang formula X2 minus X1 lah. Okay, ni kita label dulu. This one X1. Okay, and this one Y1. Okay, this X2, Y2. Okay, this, and then write down here. Okay, distance PQ equal to okay, square root. Okay, negative 2 minus 4. Okay, awak nak dekat sini, awak nak buat X1 tolak X2 pun tak ada masalah. Sebab bila kita kuasakan 2 nanti jawapan dia mesti dapat sama. Okay, negative 2 minus negative 4. So, negative 2 minus negative 4 square. Okay, plus... Dengan 6 minus 1. 6 minus 1. Okay, square. Okay, and then you dapat kat sini. Square root negative 6 square plus 5 square. Negative 6 times 6 equal to 36. Okay. Okay, 6 times 6 equal to 36 plus 23. Okay, so dapat berapa? Kejap, cik kira. Okay, 36 plus 25 square root. Okay, kat sini you akan dapat 7.81 okay, unit. Okay, settle. Okay, dia ada 2 meter, ingat. Kalau dia bagi distance. Okay, kalau dia tak bagi koordinat, guna je uh, formula untuk distance. Okay, Pythagoras theorem. Kalau dia bagi distance, dia bagi koordinat, okay, guna koordinat, tak ada masalah, senang je. X1 tolak X2 ataupun y, X2 tolak Y1 pun benda yang sama. Okay. Ha, easy peasy. Next soalan please. Okay, next soalan ni cikgu bagi uh, next video. Nanti kita buat sama-sama. Oh, yeah. Please. What?